Well, hello there, Bears fans. It is your lovely host here. It is Rai Rai. Now, I do have social media accounts on, and I will discuss that after this part of the video is over. Now, sit back, relax, put your feet out, grab some meat, or grab some drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain, and hear my thoughts, my opinions, on the subject, and of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. This one, there'll be a link. Okay, everyone knows by now that the Bears started their preseason what, on Saturday, Friday, it don't matter. Preseason don't mean nothing, Bear fans, it don't. I know they were very excited what's going to happen for the upcoming season, but preseason and regular season are two different ball games. Okay, for example, if the Bears are undefeated, does that mean they're going to have a very successful season? No, okay? So, I don't know why you guys get excited. I don't care a darn about preseason. I just care about who's going to make the roster on the, on the regular team, okay? For the schedule, you know? That's what you should be concentrating on for all the NFL fans. But everyone has their own opinion, okay? But maybe the Bears will surprise the league, or maybe they'll have a crappy season like everybody's predicting. We'll find out. Now, this head coach says... He is focused on the Bears winning the Super Bowl. I think it's kind of too early for that because I remember when Lovey Smith says, my focus is on to beat the Packers, and he did. And he took the Bears to the Super Bowl. I don't know if it's his first year or second year. He was there, but he never won it because he did not have a great quarterback. If he had a better quarterback, maybe things would be a different ball game. You know, we got a new head coach. We got new weapons, I mean, on paper, but... It could be a train wreck. And a guy who we got traded from the Patriots, I guess he got injured. Hopefully it's not he's not out for a long year. Hopefully not. They always say next man needs to step up. So all the information down below. And let's see what's going to happen with this squad. If the Bears have a crappy year, then who cares? Okay, just watch every game. Enjoy it. And hopefully all these games are very close. Maybe it'll come down to a field goal or a touchdown. And hopefully he scored scored some touchdowns, not a field goal. And hopefully this guy run it, not like um, Nagy did, like dinky passes. I want this guy aired out for Justin Fields. Hopefully, I want to see that. I don't want to see no twenty to thirty passes, you know, dinky passes. I don't want to see no screen passes. No, I want this guy. He said he has an arm from Ohio State. Well, college and pro are two different things. And I don't know if the Bears will compete with the Packers, Minnesota, maybe Detroit. You know, they still got Aaron Rodgers, so he's still going to be a threat. Just because he lost their best receiver in that um, on a roster. If they still have Rodgers, he could make these other receivers look very good. But if the receivers keep dropping, then maybe the Packers are going to have a crappy year. Okay, now everybody thinks that Minnesota is going to have a great year. Just because they, they signed some great players in have some great draft that don't mean squat and a lot of people say the Detroit Lions are going to have a great year just because they have a great draft that don't mean squat now people say the Bears are going to have a, a crappy year because they, they drafted bad and they have a overall free agency that don't mean nothing wait until it happens on the field not preseason not, ex not, not training camp the real season okay wait until a couple games in and see if they're going to make the if they're going to have a great season or not great season so all the information down below, I'm very looking forward to it. Maybe the Bears will shock the world and have a very successful season like the Bengals. Look what happened to the Bengals. I know they lost, but they have a great successful season. And then they got their buck kick in, in the Super Bowl, but they bounced back and they made some big moves in off season and then the draft. So maybe that will happen to the Bears. Kind of unlikely, but I never know. Hopefully Justin Fields will bounce back from his crappy rookie year. But well, that was Nagy's fault, not really Justin Fields' fault. Well, they always say two to tango, so I don't know who's their backup quarterback. And we lost Nick Foles. I think he went to the Colts. So it's going to be a great season, hopefully. We got to think about that all the time. And that's all I got to say. All the information down below. This is just a short and sweet video. Now, you guys can follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, all my social media accounts down below. If you really want to be part of the Robert Show, double click the link. And hopefully you and I could be the you could be part of the Raw Show. We could discuss about any kind of topic. But don't make fun of me. Have a good one, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.
Not tomorrow. See you guys next Monday. Go Bears always. Later. Woo! Let me know if you're going to live Bears games or watch at the sports bar or your friends or family house. Let me know. Later.